Hello friends subscribe to our channel GDC and press the bell icon for more updates. Hello friends, welcome back once again. Today I am going to discuss a very important topic for you that is statics of GPAT. All students are very fair about the GPAT exam that is very tough but actually it's not tough. You have to work in proper direction to get a positive result. So here just I am giving some basic points about the GPAT 2018 so that you can easily find out that what you should do during the exam. First thing, in the GPAT 2018, total 34,743 students appeared in the exam. And how much students get qualified? Only 2,858 students. That is very low. Means if I am saying this result is only 8% result. 8%. So how is all the students are not the well qualified or not have the proper knowledge? No, it's not thing. But your work during the exam that is very important. So if we discuss about the result, so what happened? Total questions in the GPAT exam that is 125 questions. And this 125 questions, total marks, maximum marks will be 500 because each questions have the four marks. So, but here only top eight students obtain marks more than 300. That is 60%. 60% marks, how much students obtain? Only eight students. Here, first ranker get 336 marks. Second ranker, 318 marks. Third ranker, 306 marks. Fourth ranker, 303 marks. Fifth ranker, 302 marks. While sixth ranker, 307, 308, 300. Ninth, how much? 298. Mean, 91 means more, less than 300. And tenth, 290. That is very low marks. So, only eight students get more than 58 marks. That is, if you will get questions, if all the students thinks about I'll do more and more questions so that I'll get the maximum marks or I'll get the very good marks but it's not actually things so you have to work properly so here if I'm say about the cutoff very low cutoff how much in the last year in the last five years cutoff marks is here in the last year was the maximum cutoff marks means general get 137 schedule cost 98 schedule tribe cost 67 that is the maximum while here 2017 general 113 schedule cost general and obc both are the same they don't have the two categories schedule cost 82 st 82 2016 115 schedule cost 90 schedule tribe cost 90 here in the 2015 general and obc how much get only 125 marks cut up marking for the sc 100 and for the st it's also 100 in the 2014 125 for the general and obc for the sc 100 and for the st it was also 100 so if you think about the last five year cut off marking means 137 was the maximum so you only have to attempt that your correct questions should you correct not the guess marking or the incorrect you are marking the just guessing the answer that is not the proper way for the gpat exam so what is the suggestion for you no need to attempt all the questions you just attempt those questions in which you are sure or maybe one or two questions in the doubt so only 60 questions are enough so if you will attempt the 60 question according to yourself that these 60 questions I know very well and these 60 questions are my right answers. So you have to attempt only 60 questions. 
In 60 question, I guess according to yourself 60 is right, but maybe 10 to 15 questions or maybe 20 questions will be wrong. So if you will get 40 to 50 correct answer, then if I am saying it about the 45, if you will get the 45 correct answers, though then your marking will be 180 and if 15 questions got wrong, then 165 that is more than sufficient to qualify the GPAT exam. So make sure during the exam you will not think to attempt all the questions. You just attempt those questions in which you are very sure or maybe doubt in one or two questions or four to five questions but make sure right answer should be answered. So I hope so this analysis will be helpful for you. So thank you.